Now, police call this guy's M.O. ruthless. He searches the obituaries. When he finds a victim, he looks at the funeral date. And that's when he strikes. How low can you go? Taking advantage of grieving families. It doesn't get much lower than that. Who would do something like this? Who would? Police say this guy. I don't know what the world's come to. Investigators tell me the crook searches the obituaries in the newspaper. He picks his prey and finds a funeral date. While families flock into the chapel, he calls the funeral home to make sure the family in mourning is there. It's gutsy and it's sad. And while the poor folks are saying their final goodbyes, detectives say the the thief is ransacking their home, taking whatever he wants. In the past month, he's hit eight homes in Washtenaw, Livingston, Monroe, and Oakland counties. Hard for money, hard for what? Just hard up. Well, police are hot on his tracks. These are surveillance photos of the man using an ATM at Bank of America and coming out of this target. Investigators believe he's driving this silver four door Grand Prix. Catch the guy. <laughs> Catch the guy. That is terrible. Now, this has become a multi county investigation. Michigan State Police detectives are also on the case. One more time, take a close look at the man in these surveillance photos. If you recognize him, you can call 1 800 Speak Up and make an anonymous tip. I'm Chauncey Glover, Local Fool.